In this video, I am going to explain your first steps on KCFX 911EX flat space. Your flat space basically is a menu based scientific calculator. We have apps, you can calculate apps for various types of calculations from calculate to complex, base and calculation matrices, vectors, statistics, distribution, and so on and so forth. Let us say you want to do a polynomial. Uh, equation solver here so you'll go into equation solver and push number two to go into polynomial and then you can solve let's say two degree three degree four degree polynomial in here so i'll say two and here you can put in your coefficients and you can calculate the value of polynomial so let me take an, a simple example let's say x square minus 5x okay i'm sorry so x and then let's say i i just say 9 just for instance okay and i said 20. okay so that is my equation x is square minus 9x plus 20 what are the roots of these i push equals to you get your first equation you push down you get a second equation and then you get your minimum of x and y as well you want to get out of it just push menu and you'll come back to the main screen where you can select the app you want to solve a basic calculation you'll or you can push one directly that is shortcut let's say you want to find out um, what should we find out let's say we would like to do a summation summation is in yellow it will use with shift shift and integration to get in okay i'm sorry that is derivative so let's say we would like to find out derivative of uh, x square minus five times x where the value of x is let's say three you hit equals to and you get the value so it's very easy and uh, intriguing in nature uh, let's say now you would like to find a summation as i was explaining earlier so you push shift and x to get the summation formula there and then let's say you wanted to find out uh, x square plus 2 starting from fifth term until 10th term you just put in in the template hit equals to to get it calculated Similarly, you have some other options there, so you have to calculate complex, so just take a simple example, let's say we would like to find out 2 plus 3i, okay, and we would like to find out the square of it, so I'll just put in this, and square, the t equals to, and it calculates the complex number and square of it. You can do other things like conjugate, etc. When you put option, you get to see more options there. So let me just again go. Then you can do base calculation. We have multiple base calculation option here, like decimal, hexadecimal, binary, and octal. Then you have matrices, you have vectors, you have statistics, distribution, spreadsheet, table, equation. I already explained about inequality, same as. Then the issue. These are uh, various apps that we have on Classbase, and uh, it's very important to mention it has something very important feature called QR code. So what QR code does basically? Uh, so let's say uh, we are in uh, statistics, and uh, we are doing uh, our one variable statistics. Let's say, okay, and we put in some values there. Let's say 25, 36, 24. Let's take 4 and let's take one more value, 20. Okay, let's calculate the one variable statistics for this. So it gives you all the values, right? Now, what is something about, special about QR code in this calculator? You hit shift and option, you see QR there and it generates the QR code. If you are doing it in the calculator, you can scan this QR code and it will take you to a website. Let me show you which website it takes you to. I'll double click here in the interface. So it takes me to the website where I can see all mean, summation x, summation x squared, standard division, population division, quartile, quartile, etc. And I can see a graph of it as well. So uh, if you would like to visualize and you see the, you want to see the graphical uh, representation of your data, you can do it. Not only this, uh, if you wanted to, let's say you're solving a polynomial equation, a simultaneous equation. You can see the graph of it as well using QR code. 
other than that something again uh, that is used uh, uh, let's say uh, we don't know how do we use table function there so i would do shift and option again it will create a qr code and this time it will not you know do visualization based on the graph but what it does let's go to the page and see what it does so okay it's asking to accept the terms and condition i'll say agree what's this okay creating a number table so basically this is uh, they, they, this is a user guide this this explain how do you use calculator to find out what this particular app can do so you put in an equation and it gives you a table for you that's pretty useful function hmm so that's it what else you would like to know something that is very important i would like to say to understand how the reset a calculator reset is on number nine so push shift and nine to go into reset command i'm sorry let me just do it at times it behaves very differently okay let's go into any of them app Oops. what's the problem my friend yep there at, at times you in the emulator you don't feel like the button is pressed so you can reset okay and please remember always reset your calculator before you enter into the examination hmm so you can reset it if you have so that's it for this video i'll make some more videos exclusive video for these apps so for that please subscribe to the channel so that you are notified of my new videos thank you very much have a good day goodbye